Inducted into the hall this year in the all-around category is Joe Beaver. began his calf roping career at age five when he rode a Shetland pony and chased after goats. Growing up in a rodeo oriented family gave him the opportunity to practice often in the family arena on 10 acres near Victoria, Texas. Joe's father Walter says it was Joe's mother who recognized that he had real talent and she would haul him to rodeos and turn steers out for him in the practice pen. When Joe was in high school he would head for home almost every day and practice roping after school while most of his friends were going for coke. Joe would rather be roping. Obviously, his hard work and practice would pay off. At age 20, rookie Joe Beaver was the youngest calf roping competitor to pull up to the National Finals Rodeo in Las Vegas in 1985. He had started his professional career with a big bang when he roped and tied a calf in 7.6 seconds at the start of the year in Denver, setting a new arena record. The winds continued to roll on from there. He maintained a spot on the top five throughout the year, and being the PRCA's only first-year member to qualify for the NFR, gave Beaver the coveted Resistall Award of Rookie of the Year. His first year didn't end there, though. On his first run at the NFR, Joe Beaver roped his calf in 9.4 seconds to win the round. Nine days later, he closed out the rodeo with another win, this time in 7.9 seconds. In his first year as a rookie, Joe had captured the world championship in calf roping and won the hearts of rodeo fans nationwide. Joe would go on to win four more world calf roping championships, 1987, 1988, 1992, and 1993. He placed second in 1994. Then, in 1995 and 96, he won the top of it all. He was crowned world champion all-around cowboy in those two years. Joe had to sit out much of the 1999 season because of a torn tendon in his pelvis. This year, Joe went to the NFR as an announcer on ESPN telecasts. Who else but Joe Beaver, the kid who had now become a rodeo legend himself, to help with the rodeo telecast. Starting the year of 2000 was hard. Joe had been working to regain his strength and stability. He began to do more team roping. And by the time the NFR rolled around, he had qualified for both calf roping and team roping. Written off by many in rodeo and the media, Joe came in at a distant 12th place in the all-around category. With a rock-steady performance in calf roping and a brilliant performance in team roping, he won $123,356, an NFR best. And of all things, he had once again won the 2000 World Champion All-Around Cowboy. I think it's because I came from so far behind, Beaver said, that I didn't even count me with a chance. When you don't count a guy with a chance, it makes him fight real hard. Maybe that's why some of us call Thomas and Mack Center in Las Vegas, Nevada, the house that Joe built. And to many in the rodeo business, he's known as Smokin' Joe Beaver. Mm -hmm. 